The first focal point that we're going to be focusing on is going to be the setup of the stroke. And it's really important because it's going to lay the foundation for the entire frame for your stroke. What I want you to do is imagine that you have a cardboard box that's in front of you about eye level. So you start by putting your hands up right here where you're going to do your pull up. And then what you do from fingertips to forearm, keep it one unit, and I want you to lightly set your hands on top of that box. Now what we've just achieved right there is what's called early vertical forearm, and that's the catch point of your stroke. You hear this buzzword a lot, but it's often kind of misunderstood. So let's go back over that again. Hands are up like you do a pull up, set your hands on top of the box. If I was to demonstrate it from here, you extend and pause, the elbow pops up, and then you have that nice early vertical forearm. Now um, what's really important about this is this is where you're going to have your most access to your power you will notice that almost all great athletes have access to this early vertical forearm. And the reason is, is that you're using the stroke specific mechanics that you're gonna be utilizing while you're swimming, while you're on the ergometer. Now something that most swimmers do, or many swimmers do, is they swim with a dropped elbow. And what that means is, instead of having a high elbow catch or early vertical forearm, they're allowing the elbow to drop down. So one of the best ways for you to set up the power for your stroke is to work on that early vertical catch or early vertical forearm. And that's one of the best ways that you're gonna set your pull up for a very solid frame stroke.